person caught on camera seen setting fire to a hillside right near a North Portland neighborhood. And tonight, people there say they know who did it, and they're calling on the city to take action. Our Valina Jones spoke to some of those neighbors today who say they're now in fear of their safety, Valina. Well, that's right, Jennifer and Jeff. After years of concern, that fear became a reality last Thursday when neighbors in this area saw part of this hillside go up in flames. They say the person responsible for that lives in a nearby homeless camp. We felt and have talked with the neighbors a lot about feeling vulnerable to accidental. Neighbors say this area is a designated wildfire hazard zone. This new video shows what appears to be a person deliberately setting a fire. Those who live here didn't want to go on camera for fear of retaliation. To actually see somebody intentionally light a torch and lay it down, toss it down in the tall dry grass and stand there and watch it build was something I did not expect to see. Neighbors think the alleged arsonist is someone staying in this illegal homeless camp. Pretty much as long as Hazelnut Grove's been there, we've had spillover from Hazelnut Grove. Hazelnut Grove is a city permitted self-governed camp on North Greeley near Interstate. The Overlook Neighborhood Association calling on the city to move the site and put in more safety measures to prevent fires from spreading. Uh, everyone's kind of on edge given how dry things are. The next fire doesn't have to be arson. It could be a cigarette butt thrown off of the side of the road or dropped by a homeless person. And suddenly this whole bluff goes up in flames as it did. The city's park division say they've removed weeds and cleaned debris from the campsite. I mean, I know we have a homeless crisis and I am sympathetic to that as well. But the solution is not to have actual tax paying citizens terrorized. Now, the city is also working to determine if the fire happened on city property, saying, quote, if so, we will be discussing the situation with the Fire Bureau and with Portland Parks and Recreation staff to identify potential next steps. Those next steps include seeing if a fire break is needed and determining its effectiveness. Now, meantime, the city has already posted notices in the area telling campers that they will be required to move by this week. Reporting in North Portland, Valina Jones, Coin 6 Nuke.